Hi everyone, this is the video shows the differentiate uh, example. Differentiate the function uh, involve the log. So uh, for all the examples of uh, this video, actually uh, we need to apply the laws of log first, then uh, before we just proceed to a differentiation. As example, we look at the question one, question A. To differentiate this function, Actually, we can uh, simplify this function by uh, applying the laws of law. Actually, we can move the 3 to the front, forming the y function become like this. And now we can actually put, uh, apply the formula. If we have a log gx, to differentiate the log gx, we can actually differentiate the gx, get the g'x, prime x, and then divide it by gx. Apply, apply this formula into here to find our dy dx. Since the y having the coefficient 3, we just write down the 3. And uh, to differentiate the log 2 minus x, as if that this is your gx, then we need to differentiate it to get g prime x, that is your negative 1, over 2 minus x, that is your gx. Then we can simplify it. You got a negative 3 over 2 minus x. All right. Now we move to the B, example B. For this question, I would first write down this uh, 1 over x squared plus 3 into this form, power of negative 1, and then apply the laws of log, bringing the negative 1 to the front. I got my negative log x squared plus 3. Okay, then only I will start to differentiate. Differentiate the uh, y, the negative 1 as a coefficient. You can just uh, write them down. And then uh, you have your gx as your x squared plus 3. So differentiate the gx, you have a 2x. And then divided by the gx itself, you have a x squared plus 3. This is the answer for the b. And uh, for the c, for the example c, we will rewrite our log function into this form first. Meaning that the square root, I change to the power of 1 over 2. And then applies a loss of log, bringing the 1 over 2 to the front. I have this. Then we can start to differentiate, get your dy dx. Again, the dy containing the coefficient 1 over 2, we just copy down the 1 over 2. And then to differentiate the log, we need to find the gx, or g prime x. Uh, means that we need to differentiate the x squared plus 1. You get your 2x. And then divided by the gx. That is your x squared plus 1. Okay, then after that, we can simplify it by cancel of the 2. Then uh, we have our final answer, x over x squared plus 1. For example, d, look like this is a uh, very complicated, the gx. So I wouldn't, I'm not going to take this as my gx. I will rewrite my question, my function into this form. Log x plus uh, x minus 2 plus log. 2x plus 3, which is uh, I apply the laws of log. Log a multiplied by b can be written as log a plus log b. Okay, then uh, after we have separated it, we can directly, we can uh, differentiate it, okay, with a very simple method, which is uh, we differentiate term by term. Differentiate the log x minus 2, we have a 1 over x minus, minus 2. How do you get the 1? Differentiating this uh, x minus 2, you get 1. Then over x minus 2. Plus, differentiate 2x plus 3, you get 2. And then divided by the function itself. Okay, this is a gx. You get a 2x plus 3. So you can just uh, leave your answer like that. Or you want to equating the denominator, it's up to you. Alright. Then now we move to the next example. I have my fx equals to this. So uh, the, I'm not going to take this as my gx. So firstly, kita, uh, we will separate this into this form by applying the rules of log, which is a uh, log a over b can be written as a log a minus log b. So apply these rules, I got this. This is my average. Then we can get our f prime x by taking, by multiply, uh, differentiating this uh, gx function. I will, I will define this as my gx. So differentiate the gx function gx. I have I have 3 over 3x minus 2. 
minus differentiate this uh, log 2x cubed plus 5x. Firstly, you need to differentiate this first. You get your 6x squared plus 5. And then divided by this uh, function itself, you get a 2x cubed plus 5x. Okay, so this is your answer. And uh, f, we have uh, this uh, uh, log and then the gs in the quotient form. Again, I will rewrite this uh, function into this log 1 minus 2x minus a log 2x plus 1. Then I will start to differentiate finding the dy dx. To find the dy dx, to differentiate this first term, I got my negative 2 over 1 minus 2x minus differentiate 2x plus 1, you get 2 divided by 2x plus 1. Okay, so this is your answer for the f. And for the g, we need to... Uh, Okay, we can uh, write this uh, 1 plus x over 1 minus x power of 1 over 2 because square root representing the power 1 over 2. And uh, bringing the 1 over 2 to the front, you get 1 over 2 log 1 plus x over 1 minus x. So log 1 plus x over 1 minus x, it can be written as a log 1 plus x minus log 1 minus x by applying the uh, rules of log. Then I will find my dy dx. After this has been done, I will find my dy dx. Again, here is a coefficient 1 over 2. First, I write it down. And then differentiating the first term, I got my 1 over 1 plus x. And differentiating this uh, 1 minus, uh, log 1 minus x, you have your negative 1 over 1 minus x. And then you can simplify it. Simplify it, you want to uh, equate in denominator, can, or you can just uh, leave this as your answer, no problem. If you want to equate denominator, you will have uh, to multiply, multiply this uh, term by 1 minus x over 1 minus x, and multiply this second term by uh, 1 plus x. The, okay, the numerator, you need to do the same, then you have, 1 minus x on top plus 1 plus x. Down here, we have a 1 plus x multiplied by 1 minus x because you have equated the denominator. Alright, then a 1 over 2 still will be outside and 1 plus 1 will be 2, negative x plus x will be 0. Then here, 1 plus x multiplied by 1 minus x, you get 1 minus x squared. And the 2 can be cancelled off, you have 1 over 1 minus x squared. That's it. All right. So this is a and this is a final uh this is a final question uh, in the in the question uh, two. All right. Thank you for watching.